Have you ever seen Chongqing like this? Tianba Bridge free of traffic at 8 a.m. A journey from Jiafeng Bay to Guanyin Town now needs only 16 minutes. Come noon, Hongya Cave and Sichiko appear to wallow in slumber. No tides of people from near or afar. No stalls offering noodles, giblets, or hemp biscuits. The once bustling streets now only see the lonely flickering of traffic lights. Our city, it seems, has gone on mute. The quiet roads, a scene we once craved for, now make us realize that after all, the bustle reflects the true peace and prosperity of our city. There lies happiness in the daily commute, meeting for hot pot on a whim. Perhaps you've never witnessed Chongqing like this before, but she retains a profound corner within our hearts. A background to the empty city streets, motivating people to the front lines. Sanctuary for the virus. Yet all have their role to play. Sit tight and steady at home. Behold the empty city, yet our hearts within are replete. Responsibility, care, love, and hope. There is no winter without end, no spring that doesn't bloom. Spring is here, cherry blossoms are soon to flower. Let us await the warm beauty of spring where we can cast aside our masks and savor the air. Ride through buildings on the monorail, walk once more towards those familiar scents and shout for all to hear. Hey boss, two liang of noodles please. For the past two days, the latest situation in Wuhan have flashed across screens. The virus may have put life on hold in Wuhan and elsewhere, but should each of us keep hold of an iron will for life, we have nothing to fear. Come on Chongqing, come on Wuhan, come on China. Wuhan, we await good tidings, ourselves alike.